This is Fawns Manor Road, two bedroom mid terrace property. We've got parking directly behind me here for the residents. You can see. We've got access from the front down the side passageway there into the back garden. It's quite nice about this one, is it's particularly large. Once upon a time, it's actually three bedrooms. And you'll see that when we get up into the master bedroom, that there's easily enough space to reinstate a wall or perhaps create a hallway giving access up into a loft room, which I believe is what one of the neighbors have recently done. So you have got a lot of scope with this one, which is quite nice. These guys have finished it to a really high standard, beautifully decorated throughout. It's in particularly good order. Nice wooden flooring through here. This is your main sitting reception room. Try and give you a bit of depth to the room here. It sort of tucks back to side onto the stairwell. So it's ample room for furnishings. You've got a little storage cupboard there, which again sits under the stairs. And it leads through quite nicely into the kitchen area. Nice rectangular size room, which gives you plenty of space to actually incorporate a dining room table. So you have got that kitchen diner fill. These have obviously got a freestanding American style fridge freezer here. This is a, let me shut this up. Look back into the kitchen. You see ample work surface space there. Room for all your appliances. We've got washing machine, a freestanding dishwasher, cooker. Obviously, fridge freezer's behind me. Combi boiler there in the corner. Just a nice size room, a lot of room to get about. Enough space to have more than one of you out here. Again, nicely finished. I'm not gonna go out into the garden because it's a little bit bleak, but we're probably about 50, 60 foot here, something in that region. Mainly laid to lawn, fair bit of privacy at the back there. It's got this brick built shed here on the left hand side, which you can just see. Fairly nice and quiet around here as well, but lots of space and the garden for having guests over if we're allowed to in the summer, which is really quite pleasant. I'm going to take you through up onto the first floor now and show you the bedrooms. Real nice homely feel to this one. It's like curving the staircase here. Nice square landing. Take you into the bathroom first. Lovely modern finish in here. These guys have just done a really tasteful job. You can see tiles all around the side of the bath. Shower fitting overhead. Mix the taps. Clean finish. This is bedroom number two. Again, really sizable double. This is ample room to walk around. Furnishings throughout. We've got two built-in wardrobes over there. Plenty of space to maneuver around both sides of the bed, have bed bedside tables. Desk obviously on the other side, lots of room. Now, this is the key. Obviously you can see you have the two windows there, so it'd be quite easy to reinst reinstate the wall to go between those two windows to create an additional third bedroom. But, I appreciate the depth of this room. And again, you can see on the left hand side, another fitted cupboard there. But absolutely huge. These guys did have it as three beds, but took the wall out, so, you know, it's down to personal preference, depending on your family size and needs. Really quite reasonably priced three bed if you do reinstate the wall, otherwise you've got a huge two bed, which makes it, easily to, makes it easy to change. We've got this cupboard here, which I believe on the neighboring house is where they've created the staircase up into the loft, which I'm told is another double bedroom and a en suite. So, you know, it currently sits as a big two bed, you could reinstate that wall to create a third bed quite comfortably. 
perhaps even four, depending on how you rejig it. But this would be where your staircase would go up into the loft. So lots of scope here. Quite pleasant. You're looking out into a little green area. Some of the residents park there. It's quite a nice little outlook. Just a really solid, good house. Beautiful condition throughout. Please get in contact if you're interested in arranging a viewing. Thank you.